What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. If you haven't already, hit that like button, also hit that subscribe button. In this video, what I'm gonna be going over is the diagnostic codes on the John Deere commercial mowers, the z tracks this is the Z950M. And many people don't know about this little feature. It's a little light, it's an indicator, right next to this wrench that will flash a code and that will help you diagnose the issue that you're having. For example, right now, I purposely have the parking brake down so when I turn this key, it's gonna flash a code, like as if I'm gonna go try to start it. See how it flashes a code, and it, what it does is it blinks two uh, times, and what it's blinking right now is it has a, it blinks once and then pauses shortly and then blinks twice, so that indicates the code is one dash two. Now, there are some codes listed right here on the side and so as you can see, that top one, the 1-2, one is brake not engaged. So that's the reason it's not starting. As well as you have 1-3, 2-5, 2-7. -2 if you ever have an issue with your mower, just make note of how these lights are flashing. And that way you can, when you take it to the dealer or your mechanic, or if you're going to try to repair it yourself, you'll know uh, what is going on or it'll send you the code. So if, if it dies while you're driving, while you're mowing, uh, try not to cut the key off. Look at that, um, how many times it's flashing and I'll let you know. Now, there's another trick. It's not gonna do it now because this one has no codes, but if it's say that it's died and it still has an issue going on, you can cycle the key three times, like go one, two and then three and if there's any codes it will start showing flashing the codes then and you'll want to leave it on the on position on that third time but real quick I'm going to go over some of the other codes that I know of that are not listed right here so basically I just got a list here and um, I'm going to go ahead and include the codes that are actually on already on the machine so 1-2 is parking brake not engaged. 1-3 is PTO or the blades are engaged, like the switch is on and you're trying to start it. Uh, two and four is engine cranking time is over 20 seconds. Uh, two, five, starter motor thermal protect. And basically it needs a 60 seconds of cool down. 2-7 is engine oil pressure. 3-1 is over voltage, batteries uh, overcharged. And 3-2 is low voltage. 3-3 is weak battery or starter system issue. 3-4 is starter relay coil output or PTO output shorted to the battery voltage. 3-5 is PTO output over, over current. 3-6 is PTO short to battery. 3.7 is output fault, you know, so then, then what you want to do is just check um, the entire wiring harness. And 5.6 PTO output circuit is open. Hi right, guys, I'm sure that's not all of them. I'm sure there's more, that's just the ones I know about. Uh, hopefully this video helps you guys out. Do me a favor, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. I'll have more videos like this coming soon guys. Thanks for watching.